U.S. government must want this Dr. Fyodor Ivanovich pretty bad to send me here. They spent a fortune in bribes and false documents just to get me this far. I guess it makes more sense to send in a lone Irish businessman, a shoe salesman at that, and a SEAL team. No loose ends, and no chance of starting a war. The government's all about plausible deniability these days. Can't say that I blame them. Intelligence reports that Dr. Ivanovich is one of the Soviet Union's top biopreparate scientists. The FBI's been keeping tabs on him for years. Seems after all this time, the good doctor wants out. My sources tell me he's in fear for his life and wants to defect. He's offering information about Soviet biopreparate activities in exchange for extraction, and ultimately his freedom. That's where I come in. I'm told that Dr. Ivanovich is being held in the Morovia Grand Hotel. A safe house for scientists, government officials, and other members of the intelligentsia. The place is heavily guarded. Hell, it's a fortress. This won't be easy, especially since I'm unarmed. I'll have to do this quietly. At least until I can meet my contact and secure a firearm. Но мне только разгрузить нужно в парк и все. Ты знаешь правила. Без пропуска проезд воспрещен. Уверен? А где это здесь? Ну минуточку. Ладно. Выше. Keep the change. Пока. You dropped your briefcase. How careless of me. Thank you. <laughs> Don't mention it. No, I think you should visit a cafe across the street. I hear the Polemka is quite good. Try the Polevka. Perhaps you would prefer Svikova instead? No, thank you. The Polevka was highly recommended. Excellent. Polevka it is. Follow me. Sorry we couldn't get you more firepower, Mr. Mullins. It's the best we could do. This is okay, yes? This will be fine. I need to be getting back to work. You can let yourself out the back, hmm? The Hotel Prague is just down the street. I wouldn't recommend going in the front door, though. I I'd look for a different way in. Thank you for your help. I'll be seeing you soon. Come speak to you, Mr. Mullins. Goodbye.
Yeah. 